Hi, I am Anna from Mini Orange. Today we're going to see how to configure SAML single sign-on in Freshdesk using WordPress as an IDP. Let's get started. Log into the WordPress admin dashboard. Navigate to the IDP metadata tab. These endpoints will be required to configure Freshdesk as SP. Let's see how to configure contact SSO in Freshdesk. Log in to your Freshdesk admin console. Navigate to the security icon in the left panel and select the Contacts tab. Then click on Custom Policies. To create a new contact policy click on Create New. In this Custom Policy section, choose the account and portal for which you want to configure the policy. Then click on Next. Click on Enable SSO Login button. To configure SSO choose SAML under the IDP of your choice tab. Download the Freshdesk metadata, this will be used to configure our WordPress IDP plugin. To set up SSO with SAML we would need to provide the required endpoints from the IDP Metadata tab of the WordPress IDP plugin. Switch back to the IDP Metadata tab of the WordPress IDP plugin. Copy the IDP Entity ID issuer and paste it under the Entity ID provided by the IDP field of Freshdesk. Switch back to the IDP Metadata tab of the plugin. Copy the SAML login URL and paste it into the SAML SSO URL field in Freshdesk. Select the appropriate signing option. Here we have selected the only signed assertions option. To provide the certificate go to the IDP metadata tab in the WordPress IDP plugin. And download the certificate by clicking on the download option. Open the certificate in a text editor, copy the value and paste it under the security certificate field. Now click on configure SSO. Now make sure the SSO login button is enabled and click on Next. Here in the Name and URL section make sure the name and URL are correct to which you want to redirect the users of these created accounts and portals. And click on Finish. You have successfully created a custom policy and configured Freshdesk as a service provider for contact SSO. Now let's see how to configure WordPress as the identity provider. Go to the WordPress IDP plugin, navigate to the Service Providers tab to upload SP metadata. Type the name of SP as Freshdesk, and click on Choose File button to upload the SP metadata file which we have downloaded previously. Now click on the Upload button. Your SP settings have been saved successfully. Now let's configure the Attribute Mapping. Navigate to the Attribute, Role Mapping tab in the WordPress IDP plugin. Select the appropriate name ID attribute, and click on Save. In the User Attributes section, under the Name column, type as First Name. Then under the User Metadata column click on the drop-down list and select the corresponding attribute. Click on the Add button to add an attribute. Type the name attribute as Last Name. Then under the User Metadata column select the corresponding attribute. And click on Save. In the Custom Attributes section, you can enter custom attributes as per your requirement. And click on Save. Your settings have been saved successfully. The setup is complete now, let's test the SSO connection. Go to the Freshdesk Admin Console. Under My Account section, copy the URL of your account and open it in a new incognito window. Click on the Login button. Scroll down, and you will see an option to log in as a customer. Click on the login link, and you will be redirected to the WordPress login page. Enter valid credentials and click on the login button. You will be redirected to the Freshdesk support homepage. In this manner, you have successfully completed the authentication and logged into your Freshdesk account as a contact. Thank you for watching our video. Check out our WordPress IDP plugin for premium features like attribute mapping, role mapping, multiple SP support, and many more.